it finally happened. I'm finally fired from my first job that I had for a very long time. It's a per diem job now. Um, I've been per diem for three years, two years, three years, since 2019, the end of 2019. I resigned back in 2019 because I knew that being a full-time employee wasn't something that I wanted to do. Um, I wanted to volunteer, but then the pandemic hit and um, so I put in my resignation and when I did, they had offered me a per diem job and I also declined the per diem job, but they insisted that I take, they meaning the supervisors there, um, said that I should take the per diem job because you know it'll suit whatever I needed to do, but I didn't want to commit to those um, per diem standards, which I thought was having to work two days in one month, but they clarified and said that I only have to commit to one day in six months. And that's all they told me at the time. So I agreed um, and stay per diem. And since then I stay per diem until today. So today is the 29th of September, but I got this certified mail. This is how it happens. So we get a certified mail and this is the certified mail. It, come, it says CRNC human resources. So I, I knew it was it when this was it when this was delivered when I saw it in person and then they send you a letter saying blah, blah blah and stuff is certified and then it's from the HR person which HR for the company they don't look out for um, the employees they look out for their business of course it's a corporation I've had encounters and I should um, share some stories about that so then they give you the guidance the the, the policy for which you're supposed to um, abide by and apparently I didn't meet those uh, qual meet those standards so um, yeah, they sent me this and then they sent me how to obtain a w W-2 form and, um, you know, after employment, how do I get the W-2 form because I have no access to it now. Um, and then there's another envelope in that manila envelope with the final check. So they didn't even have the audacity to like call me in and, you know, um, they probably was trying to call me in because they asked me to pick up a few times and I, I actually didn't decline. I said I would work, but uh, for double time because if they're short and all that stuff, they should offer double time. Um, but to me, they didn't, which was very unfair because a person that actually went in with a full-time employee and they got double time. Yes, they did. And they didn't, they didn't offer that to me. So that's very unfair because I have another job, I have a life and they call last minute, but they don't offer any incentives. Anywho, so then I got my last paycheck as well. And that's it. Now I'm terminated. And <laughs> oh, the addition, in addition to that, this was uh, two days ago, 27th. So this got here the 29th. It only took two days to get here. So I guess my official date was the 27th of September. Um, but I'm actually very happy. There's nothing to really be sad about. I s literally saw it coming and it's, I already knew it was a toxic environment for me. Um, I didn't appreciate the unfairness of management, uh, how it's all about work, 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 and um, no work-life balance. They just aren't very considerate. So I knew it was a toxic place to me, for me, and I know my worth, and everything that I had to gain for myself, I had to fight for. And a lot of people just skip by trying, like not even trying, so that's just where I stand. But yay, now it's time to go celebrate <laughs> because, I only have one job now and it's my travel job, which is great because um, I get to essentially work the times that I want to work and adjust whatever I want to do and I don't have to fall on any, and it's very stressful because, I mean, the other job was very stressful even when I'm not working all the time. Oh, and the whole reason why they let me go is, be, I think I mentioned it, but the whole reason why they let me go is they kept asking me to work, asking me to work, and apparently if it's three times that they ask and I decline, then they can let me go. And that was something that they didn't mention in the beginning, but I did, um, get the information afterwards because some other stuff happened that's very unprofessional and i'll share a video about that next time um anywho yeah i'm happy this happened this is great <laughs> um so know your worth don't keep yourself in a toxic relationship meaning a relationship with your job because they don't care about you you're you're replaceable um bah. and look my mom wants to celebrate maybe i, I should Shrimp time, shrimp cocktail. So, cheers! Mmm.